What's going on, YouTube? You're back with Shades, and we're continuing our Let's Play of Corpse Party. I'm starting to mess up my intros now. Uh, last time we left off, we started doing um, Chapter 3, and now we're with Shatoshi Mochida and Yuka Mochida, the big brother and little sister. Uh, they're, she's so cute, and he's kind of a spaz, kind of like me. Um, but uh, again, um, again, this the game's actually starting to scare me again. Uh, not really too much of a scare, but enough for me to go, please stop. <laughs> anyway, so, um, we're here in 2A, and we're apparently gonna try and exit over here, so, hmm, nothing? Okay. Um, exit north, read note on the floor. Oh, that note. Note. Victim's memoirs, 1-5. Oh, oh, Otaki Misu. Mitsuharu. I want to see you again, a ghost told me. Apparently you were brought here too, but we're in different spaces. Even though we're in the same school, I can't see you. Why does this happen to us? I shouldn't be here. I should be in my math class at prep school. My sister's gonna be really mad at me for skipping. I don't think she's gonna believe this excuse even if I told her though. Wow. I feel like if I, if I can ever find you, I'll be able to get out of here alive. I don't know why. But if we really are in the same school, then I know there must be a way of getting in contact with you, and I'm going to find it. Okay. Apparently, that's all we had to do here. So, we grab the name tag, and then we go back in this room, the creepy room that's really dark. And now we exit the other door. Oh, wait, grab a save again. Because, you know, saves are important in this game. I wonder, like, is there, like, a thing here where it's, where, like... The more saves you do, the harder the game gets. Like, being paranoid makes it so, like, you can't do anything useful. Oh. Yuka. Yuka. Big brother, will we ever be able to go home again? Or are we really stuck here until we die? It's not true, right? Big brother? Right? We'll be okay, Yuka. We'll be okay. We'll make it out of here, Yuka. All of us. Together. There's no need for you to worry, after all. You've got me, right? Oh, she's crying again. Uh-huh. That's a good girl. Big... Oh, she's crying again. she coughing? Nerves got the better of you, huh? Poor thing. I had to be strong. I have to swallow my own trepidation and show Yuka there's nothing to be afraid of. Somewhere in here, Naomi must be, may also be feeling the same. May also be feeling scared and alone. We need to find her as soon as we can. I, f I just real uh, I was just thinking something. If the teacher is the bad is the one that needs to be like, rec um uh that needs to reconcile in order for these spirits to be free, then like what was that black spirit? Like, the one that met us in Chapter 1 in the infirmary. I'm just wondering what that was. Place a loose board? Yeah! Um... Okay, main building. Okay, we're going down the stairs again. And... Shit. Earthquake. Damn, another earthquake. Yuka, grab my hand. It's over. That was odd. Normally, there was a safe button here last time. Now I'm scared. Okay, what do I do? Um, expect corpse twice to relieve or to receive a tag. The skeleton remains of a young girl sprawled across the ground. The closest she's be holding a letter in her bony fingers. Yosuke, Yosuke, I'm so sorry. If I hold hand, if I only I hadn't discovered that stupid charm. See, I told you it was the charm. Uh huh. ID tag. Yay! A junior high student. Good God. Um, go to entrance way at south. Hopefully, there's no spirits here to kill us. Cause I'm still used to dodging those. Oh crap! There's a kid over there. Okay, what am I doing? Read victim memoir 2-5 note. Important. Where is it? 
I can't see it. Oh, there it is. Victim Memoir 2-5. I'm so cold. I feel like the heat is oozing out of my body bit by bit. And then there's that sound that just won't stop. What is it? My ears hurt. I can't focus on anything. I feel like there's a thin film surrounding my entire brain. Well, if you want to get into anatomy and physiology about that, mm, I can say a couple things about that. There's no film around your brain, but there's definitely a lot of fluid in there just to make sure that there's enough so you don't touch the um, edges of your skull. Whatever. I found a dying message next to one of the corpses earlier. It said there, there's a hallway somewhere in here that it changes its size, appearing longer or shorter, pretty much on whim. I wonder where it is. I hate that I don't feel anything when I see a human body anymore. It sickens me. Huh. Um, entrance way. Exit and go all the way right to enter the, sta the stairway to 2F. Exit. Oh. I'm guessing that kid over there, it's a, it's a bad idea. Because I see it. I don't want to see it. Nope. Why are we, uh, you, uh, dead kill me? You pay. Okay. Is he gonna follow us now? Um, go all the way north. All the way to enter the stairway to 2F. Okay. I'm guessing that kid's gonna follow us around now. Go up. Okay, sorry guys if I keep looking. Go the way north of the stairway. Okay. Infirmary. Yup, there's the room again. And here's. What the fuck? Uh, I hate when this happens. It's always so creepy. So creepy. I swear, so. Oh, that's so weird. That's so weird. Someone better explain that. Oh, corpse. Do I dick? Do I inspect it? Yep. The skeleton remains of a female student are sprawled across the floor, pinned to what's left of her school uniform is a student ID name tag. Uh, Megumi Sugui. Sugi. I pick up the unknown key and go upstairs. Okay. Okay, got that. Pick up unknown key. Yes! I always pick up items in games like this. Because puzzles. I hate games like this. Normally. But the story is great. <coughs> Okay, what am I doing now? Uh, da 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 da. Uh, oops. No, my bad. Going to girls' lavatory then. Uh, shit, big brother. Hmm? Hmm? What's up? I have to go potty. Uh, oh well, the science says there are lavatories, so go ahead. I'll wait for you here. Okay. No! You can start to ask, but which one is it? PP. Gotcha. If anything happens, just yell real loud, okay? Okay. I hate asking such a personal question, but this place is full of surprises. I need to I need to know how long to wait before getting worried. Oh, hey, done already? I couldn't go. Oh, she's scared. Oh, that's so cute. Huh? Oh, I'm guessing I have to go in there now. Then go out. What? Um. Go inside, girl's lavatory. Go back to 2F. All the way inside? Uh oh. Seriously? You weren't kidding. You really couldn't go. Let's try to find another bathroom, okay? Can you hold it? Oh, she can't hold it. She's so tiny. With a tiny butt, with a tiny body control. Oh, so cute. Okay, okay, apparently we're going to the infirmary now. The dreaded infirmary. Be nice if the boys' room were an option, at least. Well, apparently it's boarded up. I'm guessing that happened in another space, because sometimes things in other spaces affect what happens here. That corpse scared me for a second. Okay, we're going to the infirmary now. Uh, oh, sh I hate when this happens! Seriously, it's not cool. I don't know why that's happening, and I hope later chapters explain that. Come on. Okay. Yay, go in.
Inspect the bed, read newspaper article, then exit. Oh, save point! Yay! I'm so sorry, Seiko. Naomi? Naomi? Is that Naomi? That means it, it, in her space, she's somewhere close to us. Hmm. Hey. Excuse me. Save again. Yes. Okay. Um, sorry guys, just checking my time. Inspect the bed. This bed's a lot less dusty than I would have imagined because people were sleeping in there and it kind of moved the dust, you know. Uh man. It's kind of, that's really, really cool. How other spaces can affect this one. Oh, but the thing is, like, I thought it was, um, Shinozaki, or whatever her name was, in the, in chapter two, who was putting the candles everywhere. Um, and there's one in the stairwell for the, to the first floor, and it wasn't there this time. Either the earthquake took it away, or the ghost took it away. I don't know. But, uh, I'm, I'm kind of trying to wrap my, wrap my mind around that. That's, it's still pretty cool. Uh huh. Big brother, I'm tired. You are? Do you want to take a quick rest before we go then? You rest here with me too, big brother. Um, I don't know. I don't know. It sucks. If you insist, I guess. If you insist, but I certainly can't hurt to lie down for a bit. I'd be worried leaving you here by yourself anyway. Hmm. Really? Really? Uh, yeah, me too. I feel like what time- I wonder what time it is. It feels like it's probably time for dinner with mom. I'm not sure. My watch stopped a while ago. I want to go home. Don't worry, we'll get home. We'll find a way. Once we meet up with Naomi, Yoshiki, and the others, I'm sure we'll come up with something. They're probably all looking into possible escape routes themselves right now. We'd better keep up with the search too or else we'll look like slackers by the time they find us. Either way, it'll work out. I know it will. Okay, if you really believe that. Then I'll believe it too. Yuka. It'll all work out, huh? We can't even open the windows here, much less get outside. He basically just told her that we can circumvent reality. Nothing but empty words, thin as paper. But I guess it's the only hope to, of this game that gives us a reason to keep going, to keep living. All we can do is tell ourselves we'll find a way out and pray that it actually happens. I fear for this guy. He got kidnapped. Ugh, where am I? Ugh, my head is pounding. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Ugh, uh, it's you. Where the hell did you take me? Children and horror things are always creepy. As much as that one spirit over there has no head. Where's, where's Shinozaki? Oh, teacher's back. Oh shit. Oh shit. Ugh, my legs! I can't stand up! Oh shit! God damn it! Oh god. I'm so scared for that guy. Seriously. What am I doing? There's no time to be sleeping. Oh, she woke up. You woke up the baby. You woke up the baby. This isn't home. Aww. Don't cry, Yuka. It's only gonna be a little longer, I promise. Aw, oh, poor baby. Poor baby. When we get back, I'll buy you some rock candy, okay? The green kind with a sweet red bean flavor? You bet. 
I know which one you've been. Cra I know how much you've been craving it. Okay, I'll be good. That a girl. Food. Get gets her every time. So cute. I'm worried about Naomi. I hope she's got someone to keep her company. Shinohara, or anyone, really. She may be strong willed, but she loses heart really quickly if no one's there to keep her grounded. Come on, Yuka, let's go. You can stand, right? Uh huh, I'm okay now. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, my ear itches. If you get tired again, we can always come back. Okay. Okay, where is that newspaper article? Oh! Well then! That's not creepy! Save! S or as PewDiePie says, SAVE STATION! Gotta love my save station! How was that? How's that impression, huh? Read the newspaper. There's a section of old newspaper on the floor. Read it. The walkthrough says yes! Four children abducted and killed. Follow up report. Follow up? Oh, wait. Oh, uh, this. Are we gonna read the same thing again and again? The brutal, shocking deaths of the recent kidnapped grade schoolers have now been traced back to the hand of the instructor found in the room with them. A large pair of sewing scissors were found in his possession. And these were confirmed to be the tool used in removing the victims' tongues, ultimately leading to death through excessive bleeding or choking. One of the victims even had their, the majority of her head slowly and methodically removed. This cranial mass was found on the floor next to her body. Of these children, one was blank when investigators arrived at the scene of the crime. She was blank, but somehow blanked. The blank of blank 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 blankety blank blank. And the newspaper was torn at this point. The bottom half of the article is missing. As per usual. Big brother, the children in this picture. Yeah, that's the girl in the red dress. And the boy wearing shorts, he's the one we saw earlier. The someone who seems to have made this no made notes on the margins of the article using a red pen. Friends killed by spirits of children. Law, purpose, spread of the curse, gathering? Children with no tongues, girls with top of head missing, girl in red dress. Child victim, grudge, give shape to school of building. No, escape. Hmm. I wonder. Okay, we're gonna have a save again. Because that's all the time I have for this part, unfortunately. I know this part's a little short, but again, I I um I, I gotta keep these timely, and I don't know how long the next couple parts are. And uh, I mean, the the rest of the game will be before I hit another save point again. Because again, this game gets kind of annoying when it comes to um figuring out when to uh when giving you save points and uh, if I use the save and quit option in the menu it just sends me back to my last checkpoint and that's kind of annoying to redo everything so um, anyway like again this game is turning out really great uh, again I, I don't really get to the meat of the story until the middle of the chapters but I, I'm, I'm really excited to see what's happening later because like I don't know it's it's really great I really want to keep keep at this it's mm, so much fun, so much fun. But I guess I was going to have to wait to the next recording session. Anyway, you are now exiting the Shadyverse. My name's Shades, and I hope you've enjoyed your day in the shade. See you guys later. Oh yeah, if you like this video, hit that like button. If you want to see more from me, hit the subscribe button. I messed up the outro again. And after last time I did perfectly, just switch them, switch them. Switch, switch them, please. Please. Anyway. Enjoy your day, guys.